it's time what's up everybody welcome back to my channel i hope that you're all doing well if you're new here my name is sam i post all things lifestyle faith travel vlogs all the things this channel is essentially a video diary of my life and today we're getting ready for christmas it is actually november 19th right now i think this is the earliest i have ever decorated for christmas but i'm just i'm just feeling ready and also i'm gonna be away you know with family over the thanksgiving week or that weekend and so i want to come home and have everything done so i thought that i would just get cozy this sunday night and start decorating i hope to do everything today but if i don't at least i'll get the majority of it done so i have my tree here and I think I have some other miscellaneous things I might have thrown in that box. And then I have a bunch of other decorations in here. And so before I do anything, I need to go at least through this because I don't even know what I have. So let's do that together. Okay, so let's see. I have my Christmas tree skirt. I have a lot of ornaments in here. So that's what's in here. I have a couple of nutcrackers. Just, okay, so this is just miscellaneous thing some garland that goes around i think i put this around my entertainment center last year this is my little christmas countdown howls that i may or may not use this year some little christmas trees that's cute i don't even remember that the gnome salt and pepper shakers iconic really some string lights that again may or may not use this year how adorable is this little guy come on you know where he's going i don't even have to tell you stud muffin. My little berries also for my little entertainment center. And then I think the rest is mostly just ornaments. So that's going to come later, obviously. And I think I have a couple things in my closet as well as a few new things I got from Target this year. So this video is mostly going to be montages, but I do plan on speaking throughout the video, but I haven't even taken down like my fall stuff yet. So first and foremost, let's go through everything that needs to go. Okay, so that is a real pumpkin. That's gotta go. I unfortunately don't like pumpkin or else maybe I would cook it, but I don't like pumpkin. So that's gonna go. This garland's gonna go. These cinnamon sticks, they don't smell like anything anymore. So those are garbage. Garland's gonna go. These are gonna get replaced with those little cranberry things that I just showed you. My orange throw blanket that is only for fall, so that's gonna go back in the closet. This is where I put my Christmas tree last year. So that has to move, which I don't know where I'm gonna put it, and that has to move. I don't remember where I put it last year, but the Christmas tree is gonna go back here and I'm going to love it with this new mirror. I didn't have it last year, and so I think it's gonna look really, really good right there those pumpkins obviously gotta go these salt and pepper shakers are gonna get switched out for the gnomes and that pumpkin has to go away i actually don't have anything yet for here i don't think but we'll figure that out and then these are all real as well and they're actually starting to rot so those are gonna get thrown out and then i'll just switch out the little hand towels throw those in the laundry and put some christmas ones in and there's not much going on in my room at all except for this and i actually love this i'm deciding on whether i should keep this but the pumpkin is obviously gonna go away and that's really all for my bedroom and i just went into the closet and i found this little guy and i found this little stocking that i can probably do something cute with so yeah i have my fireplace <laughs> fireplace going behind me i'm either gonna put on like a podcast or some christmas music i haven't decided and we're just gonna tear this apartment up and then put it back together and make it look really nice so let's get started <laughs>
Okay, I did all the basic stuff and it looks pretty good so far. It's coming together. The part that I have been dreading, the tree. It's really just, it's not the ornaments part, it's just the actual assembly of the tree and the lights and all that. It's not always my favorite thing. I usually always kind of pass that off to somebody else, but it's just me, myself, and I, so we're doing it and you're coming with me. So tree time, let's do it. Okay, I did it. She's up. So one thing that I don't think I ever, ooh, there are no lights here, hold on. Okay, the one thing I don't think I ever told you guys about this apartment is that some of the flooring in the living room is not level, um, kind of like along the walls, only like right here where the tree is and then where that tree is. So that tree sometimes looks like lopsided all the time and I constantly have to fix it. So I completely forgot and I had these like cardboard slots, these little cardboard cutouts in here that I guess I did last year and I was like, what is this? And then I realized, so I had to slip them under this side of the tree so the tree looks even. We did it, it's fine. The one thing I also forgot is that my tree topper broke last year, completely forgot. So that's one thing that I'm gonna have to buy that you won't see in this video, but I'm sure I'll post it on Instagram or something. But the important part is up, the tree is up. So I'm gonna start placing ornaments and this is the fun part, the whole pulling the branches apart and making sure that there are no bald spots absolutely drives me crazy. That is the worst part just because I feel like it takes forever. So now the fun part is left. So I'm gonna start placing ornaments and montage in three, two, one. Alrighty guys, I think I am done for now. Mine is the tree topper and I need to get bathroom like hand towels to replace the fall ones in there. But other than that, I think everything's done. So I'm gonna give you a brief overview of what we've got going. So I really like the way the mantle came out. Those stockings are new and the stocking holders are from Target. That cute little stocking, I don't even remember where this came from, but I remember I didn't hang it up anywhere last year, so I knew I definitely wanted to do that. And then this little garland I've also had for a while. It lights up, but I don't think I'm gonna light it up right now. And then my little like fake cranberry, I don't even know what you would call this. I have to keep spreading it out though, cause it's been in that box for so long that it got kind of smushed, so I just have to keep playing with it so that it's full. Nothing really new going on on the couch, but that, that pillow is new actually, it's from Target. It's huge, I don't know if you can tell. It's really big and it's pretty and I feel like it complements 
this throw blanket that I had here last year and I really love it. I don't use it as far as like sitting on the couch. It just kind of stays there for decorative pur purposes and I love it. So on my shelves here, these two little gnomes, if you can see me in the play button, hi. These two gnomes were given to me as gifts last year and I didn't have anywhere to put them. I didn't have shelves, so I kind of just had them hid away. But this year they are on full display. I got this guy here and he actually rocks back and forth. I've had that since I was a child and when I moved out of my mom's house, I asked if I could take it. Uh, hi, Maya girl. I have a little tree here and some Yankee candle like Christmas scents that I'll probably never light, but for Christmas purposes, they look cute. I've had them for a while, to be honest. So that's really all that's different on the shelves. Just a little something, nothing crazy. I have my Christmas countdown, 36 days till Christmas. I really don't think I have ever had my decorations up this early, but he's cute. I had that last year, that is not new. For now on the dining room table, I put this nutcracker here because I didn't know where else to put him, frankly. He didn't fit on the shelves, he's too tall. Um, so until I get something to put as like the centerpiece, He's going to chill there, I guess. And then I have my little gnome salt and pepper shakers that I don't fill. They're really just there for decorative purposes. And I think that they're adorable. And here is the tree in all of her glory. She's a skinny little thing. But she looks really good and really full. I got her on Amazon last year. Again, picture a tree topper. I ordered a gold star that's going to sit on the top. So you can kind of just picture that. But I think she's cute. My little um, skirt, I think you call it, is from Amazon and I like it because it just meshes in with the rug that I have here all year round. And it kind of just looks like snow and also when the presents are under the tree, it all just looks really pretty. So I think she looks really good. I have a couple new ornaments on there from just like my travels this year and I can't wait to just keep getting more and I can't wait to have an actual topper up there. And then last but not least in my room, my aunt actually just gifted me this today when I saw her. She wanted to get me an early little Christmas gift, something that I could decorate with, which is so sweet. So it's a little lantern. I know it's hard to see, but there is a handle up here and it just lights up and it's got three snowmen in there like a little snow globe type thing it's so cute and it really just provides like a decent amount of light in here my camera's having a hard time focusing but you get it they look really cute and I did decide to keep this this brown like plant next to it because I just really like it so super cute so that's going to about do it for this video, guys. It's probably a short video, definitely more of a just casual hang out with me while I decorate. And it was really nice to have some company, even though I know you're not really here, but you know, it's just fun for me. Um, so yeah, I think my apartment's really cute. Again, earliest I've ever decorated, but I'm honestly so glad I did it because now I don't have to worry about it during the week. And when I get home from Thanksgiving week and weekend, I can come home and it's done and I don't have to worry about it. So super glad I did it. Um, but again, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope that you enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.